Cute the Christian foodie. It is another Vlogmas video, and finally, yes, finally, I am going to show you how to make coquito. It has been long time coming, but as we're coming to the end of Vlogmas, you can now have coquito, and I want to take you all the way into the new year and as far as you ever wanted to go. Okay, so we're going to dive into making this coquito. It's gonna be nice and fun. I'm gonna link the recipe in the description below, so click on that, grab you the recipe, and let's get to it. Here are the ingredients that you're gonna need to make your coquito. One 12 ounce can of evaporated milk, one 15 ounce can of sweetened cream of coconut, one 14 ounce can of sweet condensed milk, one 15 ounce can of coconut milk, three cups of Crucian Light or Crucian Coconut Rum, if you live in a part of the world that you're not blessed to have Crucian, and the other rum would do. We're gonna need a teaspoon of ground cinnamon, two cinnamon sticks, and two teaspoons of pure vanilla extract. What I've done because I, my blender is only so big. I poured everything into a bowl and I'm going to blend it in batches and then I'm gonna bottle it up. That's the easiest way to do it based on the, um, the ingredients that we use for the coquito. So I poured everything, rum, all the milks, everything is in here and now I'm going to blend it out. Bowl, blender, turn it on. I ended up batching the coquito because I put it all in the big bowl but what tends to happen is that all the cream and everything settles to the bottom so what I did the first batch that blended I put it in these bottles and then once I blend out the second batch I'm gonna use it to fill up the rest so it's nice and even and the flavors will be really good you will know that the coquito is finished and fully blended when the pieces of the cinnamon have disintegrated and everything is just smooth. That's what you're looking for. A nice smooth consistency. You really won't find much chunks, but you just want to have everything incorporated as best as you possibly can. I blended the second batch and, and now I'm going to fill it out in the rest, the next two bottles and then whatever extra I have, I'll put it in another bottle as well. And that is basically coquito. I'm gonna add a few cinnamon sticks to the bottles and let those really get the flavor of the cinnamon into the coquito. Those are gonna go in the fridge for a couple hours, then we good to go. Coquito ain't that difficult, people. You know, people have different variations to it. You know, how much coconut milk to condensed milk to cream of coconut, to each his own. I feel like this is my tried and true recipe. I do it every year with my best friend, Shania, and it always comes out really, really good. And if it ain't broke, don't fix it, pretty much. And now that you have this recipe, you can now make coquito pancakes. Linking the video right here so you could go ahead and make those yourself and just really enjoy it for the rest of the holiday season. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Actually, no, we're not finishing the video yet. I'm actually gonna pour out some coquito for you so you can see us drink it. That's important.